What up, big kids? Sean Long here. It's time for another long and uncut review. This time we're looking at the Overwatch Ultimate Sombra um, video game action figure from Hasbro. As you know, I love Overwatch and I'm loving this new Overwatch line. And of course, Chewy has to drink a whole bunch of water because he's so thirsty, even more so than I am during uh, these reviews. But I love uh, these figures and you can pick up your Sombra or Lucio that I reviewed or all the other figures are viewed at Big Bad Toy Store. Click the link for so much more. So here we got the packaging, which I love. Beautiful picture of Sombra. You can see her in the window display packaging. Um, it says, warning you won't choke on your Sombra because, uh, yeah, like, uh, oh man, I was trying to think of a funny joke, but, um, no gusta <laughs> if you oh that's so bad yeah, it's funny because i'm part spanish and my family speaks a lot of spanish spanish and they don't eat never taught me and i'm still bitter about that uh it says blizzard hasbro uh and see it continues on the side a uh, sombra's little thing she is damaged with in the overwatch logo and seeing a little bio she is 30. she's a hacker um they don't have her name, it's like been hacked away, so that's really cool. Um, yeah, so you can see the other Fierce Line, uh, Tracer, which I'm still thinking about getting, even though I got a Figma one. Lucio, who I reviewed, Reinhardt, who I reviewed, and the Reaper Black, Black Watch Ray skin, which I'll plan to pick up. So, yeah, let's open her up. And as, uh, oh wow, she comes with so many cool accessories, and I love her outfit. Oh wow, she has little toes. Oh, that's so cool. So let's uh, do the figure first. And I always love Sombra's look. She's Mexican. She's Latina. And um, it's really great to have so much representation in uh, Overwatch from all over the world. And um, yeah, Sombra, like I actually met the voice of Sombra. She is, so that's a sweetheart. And yeah, it's so cool. Like, oh man, I just love her look. Hasbro really did a great job. Really beautiful skull, but I love her eyes. I uh, love her hair. She always loved how she had this really cool faded look and her outfit. One thing I, I love about a lot of the ladies in Overwatch, you know, they're, they're wearing practical things. Sombra's wearing like a trench coat, which she's a hacker, you know. He's, I mean, Widowmaker is more probably the most sex sexified uh, Overwatch character, but you know, she's French and French ladies are very open about that kind of thing even if they're assassins but sombra you know wearing a trench coat she's very modest and i really like that um and i really love the colors uh she definitely likes bright colors even though she's a hacker and she has her little i forget like the the little thing that she has that uh, makes it so she can like just teleport out of there she has the uh man I, anyway she has a lot of cool um little devices yeah she has her for translocator i think yeah that's what it was called but yeah i really love the blue and the purple and just such a beautiful sculpt her hair is so cool you know how it's like shaved on one side i actually had that this hair for a while not like with the the, the purple but still very cool and she has this cool shade she kind of has like her toes i guess like the way her feet are it's like makes it easier so she's like Oh, she has peg holes at the bottom, which is really nice. But yeah, really great sculpt. I really like it a lot. And for articulation, even though like the collar and Sombra's head can fully rotate, you just kind of mess with her hair. Her head can look up and down and side pivot, so she has like, you know, you know, like, I s love to stay in chat, but I don't want to. <laughs> I love that. And um, her arms can fully rotate. They go in and out. This is really a butterfly joint, uh, bends a little over 90 degrees at the elbow and rotates at the elbow, rotates the wrist as well as go in and out. Um, it's really hard to tell. Uh, let's see, I think, yeah, she has like a diaphragm waist joint. I can't really tell if it's waist or diaphragm. It's, it looks like, oh yeah, she, it's just like Anna and Mercy in them. So she does have the ab crunch forward and back and the diaphragm joint. So that's cool, even though with the coat, which, I think is removable. Yeah, it looks like it could, but I don't want to test it out. But um, yeah, it, it's pretty articulated. And her legs can move forward that much, can move back. She can, um, 
Yeah, uh, pretty much through the splits, which is awesome. This is very pliable, so it won't hinder the articulation. Uh, rotate the upper part of the leg. Uh, bend at two points at the knee. Doesn't look too bad. And the ankles can pivot forward and back, and she has an ankle pivot side to side. So Hasbro always delivering on the articulation. And yeah, you can do some really cool, uh, really nice stances and whatnot. Now Sombra does come with all the accessories you would think she would come with. She comes with some extra hands, which uh, kind of like gripping hands. Uh, like she has like with her nails and her gloves, it looks really cool. Really like the, the gloves. And then she comes with her machine, submachine gun pistol, which has, um, it's black with this like blue paint. Can really cool. And you can place that in her hand. She holds it in a very stylized way, which I like. Yeah, and then she comes with her uh, translocator, or yeah, this is the other thing with works with her back, which you know she places on there and she'll uh, teleport to where she is. So that's really cool that they included that. The no moving parts, but it's just black with some pink in the middle. And then last but not least, she comes with her hacking uh, tool or a little effect because it, it's like a little hacking, hacking effect she does throughout the game when she's hacking random people online. And it has her little Sombra skull and uh, it has like the hand, it has little holes for her fingers. And yeah, it looks really cool. So um, yeah, I try and think if you put it with this hand. Um, yeah, try to put it on here. Yeah, I think if you, I, or this will work with this hand maybe. Maybe it, it's meant for this hand. Yeah, it's meant for the other hand. So yeah, let's switch out the hands here. And switching out hands on these are, are easy you just always want to be careful because even though plastics oop, I just knocked over mercy uh, you just always want to be careful so okay put in the hand oop, and then you just put in the uh, it has like three holes for the fingers and thumb which is great and yeah there you go she has her hacking effect Chewie, of course, is playing with his toy, which I'm happy that he is, but, you know, why now? Why? You know, this is what part of the long uncut review is. You get random noises from a corgi because, yeah, that's what makes these videos worth watching is just hearing a corgi play with random things. So, yeah. So, yeah, this, uh, you just got to place the fingers in the right holes. <laughs> that's what she said. Uh, but, um... Yeah, it looks really cool. That is really awesome. That's so cool. And then, yeah, you can probably peg that out. Yeah, so I, I like that a lot. All right, so let's measure Sombra. There we go. Oop. Yeah, and of course, you gotta just be careful with um, her hacking. Oop. I'll just take this off for now since we're just gonna measure out now. So. Let's measure Sombra and see where she stands. She stands a little under six inches tall uh, with her hair. And compare her to her uh, Talon um, Buddy Reaper. And compare to uh, Lucy Oh Oh. And uh, compare to like another awesome female, Captain Marvel, since this is in the same scale, and then uh, Black Widow. Yes, yeah, so, very awesome. Whatever, oop, whatever, oh, of course Black Widow had the fall. She had the fall. <laughs> oh, Natasha, why? Anyway, so yeah, Sombra is awesome. I love her accessories. I love these Overwatch figures. Um, I want them to do the whole team, I mean whole team, all the characters, and uh, Sombra has some great skin, so I wouldn't mind buying Sombra in a whole different skin. She's just so cool, and uh, yeah, I'm really happy with the way this figure turned out. It looks awesome, and Sombra just has such a cool look, so 
Definitely recommend this. Pick this up for about 20 bucks at Big Bad Toy Store. Click the link for so much more. She's ready to hack the planet. So yeah. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed the review. Stay tuned for some great reviews for May the 4th and some other great things uh, coming up. And for more, check out my website at seanxlong.com. Like me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, links in the description. I'm Sean Long, remember live long and love life.